You know, I, I thought long and hard about what I wanted to talk about today because we go back such a long, long way and we dream, dream so many of the same dreams. I, I didn't know whether I wanted to talk about Lionel the Warrior who one time when we went to a little place called Sloan's over on 3rd Street, <laughs> I went in looking for a fight. <laughs> Lionel was trying to cool me out. <laughs> in about 20 minutes, we had, I, had, I had a couple of young ladies at the table and Sloan's was just the best place in the world for me at that time. But I couldn't find Lionel anywhere. He had gone somewhere. I look out the window and Lionel is tapping on the window saying, come on, come on. Me and my other buddies jump up and run outside. Lionel has left two dudes lying on the sidewalk <laughs> in pools of their own blood because they were not right. <laughs> so he had a very strong sense of right and wrong, and he was indeed a warrior. But I want to talk about today the best. Oh, I started to say I don't want to say this in front of the kids, but I forgot all our kids are grown now. I can say whatever I want to say. <laughs> Lionel, I'll call this. The best fucking day that ever happened. Now we were doing Sesame Bonds Is Dead and it was an incredible experience because when we were doing it, it had an impact on the country. It had an impact on the world because apartheid was still in place. And we were traveling around the country and telling the people in the hinterlands about the evils of apartheid and how this system had to be stamped out. And Lionel was once again a warrior because we were there and we were telling them in the way that our brothers in South Africa would tell them. So we come back to Chicago after a triumphant tour. And we're going to do it on the South Side for a predominantly black audience. The first time we've ever really had the opportunity to do this. And we go into the theater and it's not exactly a theater, but it's theater enough. Because we know we're getting ready to have some folks in there that are going to enjoy themselves. So we start to do the show, it unwinds and it's a phenomenal show. It's just beautiful. Lionel was brilliant in this show. It was the best work I've ever seen him do. At one point in the show, the character that Lionel is playing strips himself naked and stands nude in front of the audience and asks, what's wrong with me? <laughs> <laughs> 